Dr. Sheree Phillips, National Spokesperson for the Susan G. Coleman Three Day, and the host of your opening ceremony. I am so incredibly honored to be part of this extraordinary family. And it's a big family. There are more than 40,000 of you in all 14 three-day cities this year, and your names are inscribed on this wall behind me. Each name is part of the collective Coleman family. Mothers and daughters, husbands, wives and partners, sisters, neighbors, aunts and friends, all united by one cause. I am happy to join you here today as a survivor, as a past walker. I know the excitement, the optimism, and even the jitters going through you right now. Am I going to make it? Yes, you will. Can I do this? Yes, you can. You have trained and fundraised for weeks and months. You did train, right? <laughs> and you did it with one goal in mind. To be here, you gave it your all. You asked co-workers for their support, friends for encouragement, spouses for understanding. Standing all around you are women and men just like you. Women and men whose stories you will hear as you make your way through this three-day journey. Who will inspire you and whom you will inspire. You are heroes, united by your courage to act. Your courage to do more to be part of something bigger than yourselves, to raise more money and walk farther than anyone else, to show the world what's possible, what you can do. deserves the right to hear about their daughter's first kiss. That everyone deserves the right to stand next to the one they love and say, I do. That everyone deserves the right to sow the seeds of family and watch the generations bloom. To experience the special bond between a grandchild and a grandparent to watch springs and summers come and go and sunrises turn to sunsets to know the joy and splendor of a life fully lived complete with moments big and small but let us not forget those whose life seasons ended too soon those who deserved more days, more moments, more time with each of you. Let us honor the ones we've lost, whose absence we feel so strongly today at the center of our hearts. We are here because they are not. Now, please, to the center stage where the names of our loved ones rise up to remind us of their brave spirits. I ask you to meet the sad silence in your hearts with a defiant call. Call out the names of your heroes. Give them a voice. Bring them fully into the present, into this moment filling our journey ahead with their grace and beauty. With this new team on that's it. Thank you. This morning is filled not only with memories, but with an unwavering hope for the future. Now, 
please welcome the living, breathing proof of our greatest hopes.